Thinking about moving to Brazil as an LGBTQ plus individual? Welcome to our comprehensive guide designed to provide you with the essential insights you need when contemplating such an exciting transition. In this video, we'll explore the best cities in Brazil for LGBTQ plus individuals, highlighting their unique features, vibrant cultures, and inclusive communities. We'll also delve into the legal landscape of LGBTQ plus rights in Brazil, comparing them to international standards and other nations. But that's not all. We'll go beyond the physical relocation and help you discover local LGBTQ plus support structures, healthcare considerations, and social acceptance levels. With a dash of humor and a sprinkle of puns, we aim to make this journey engaging and relatable for you. So whether you're drawn by the allure of Rio's carnival or the charm of Sao Paulo's cosmopolitan lifestyle, we've got you covered. Stay tuned as we navigate through this exciting journey together. What are the best cities in Brazil for LGBTQ plus individuals? That's a question we hear often and today we're going to answer it for you. Let's start with the cultural powerhouse of Sao Paulo. Known for hosting one of the world's largest pride parades, this metropolis is a beacon of diversity and acceptance. The city's LGBTQ plus scene is lively and varied with an array of bars, clubs and community centers that cater to all identities. Sao Paulo's rich cultural tapestry, coupled with its strong support structures for the LGBTQ plus community, make it a highly attractive option. Next, we fly to the northeastern city of Salvador. Known for its Afro-Brazilian culture, Salvador is a city that thrives on its diversity and inclusivity. The city boasts a thriving LGBTQ plus scene, with its annual carnival being a particular highlight. Salvador's strong sense of community and acceptance is palpable, offering a warm welcome to those seeking a new home. Our third stop takes us to the city of Curitiba, located in the southern part of Brazil. Curitiba is known for its high quality of life, progressive policies, and welcoming atmosphere for the LGBTQ plus community. The city is home to a number of LGBTQ plus organizations and events, including the annual diversity parade, making it a vibrant hub for the community. Each of these cities offers something unique. Sao Paulo with its bustling energetic vibe, Salvador with its rich cultural heritage and sense of community, and Curitiba with its progressive policies and high quality of life. But what they all have in common is an unwavering commitment to inclusivity and diversity. They offer a safe, welcoming environment for LGBTQ plus individuals, with robust community support and a vibrant culture. In Brazil you'll find cities that not only accept you for who you are but celebrate you. Each of these cities offers a vibrant and welcoming community for LGBTQ plus individuals. So, pack your bags, the adventure awaits. How does Brazil's legal landscape look like for LGBTQ plus individuals, you may ask? Well, let's dive in and explore that. Now, Brazil is a country that has been at the forefront of LGBTQ plus rights in Latin America. It's important to note that Brazil was one of the first countries in the region to decriminalize homosexuality back in the 19th century. That's a pretty significant milestone, wouldn't you agree? But it doesn't stop there. Brazil has continued to make strides in LGBTQ plus rights. In 2010, Brazil's Supreme Court ruled that same-sex couples have the same legal rights as heterosexual couples. This includes rights to inheritance, adoption, and social benefits. Fast forward to 2019 and the Supreme Court made another landmark decision. It ruled that discrimination based on sexual orientation or gender identity is equivalent to racism, and therefore, a crime. Now how does this compare to other countries? Well, let's just say Brazil is ahead of the curve. Many countries around the world are still grappling with issues of discrimination and lack of legal protections for LGBTQ plus individuals. Brazil's proactive stance is a beacon of hope. But it's not all rainbows and sunshine. Despite these legal protections, Brazil still grapples with societal discrimination and violence against the LGBTQ plus community. It's a stark reminder that laws alone cannot change societal attitudes overnight. While the legal landscape is promising, it's crucial to remember that the lived experience of LGBTQ plus individuals can vary greatly. It's essential to connect with local LGBTQ plus organizations and communities to get a real sense of what life is like. So, what does all this mean for someone considering a move to Brazil? It means you're moving to a country that has made significant strides in legal protections for LGBTQ plus individuals. However, it's also a country where societal acceptance is still a work in progress. Understanding your legal standing is crucial when considering a move to a new country. 
It gives you the foundation to navigate your new environment confidently and safely. And remember, while laws are important, it's the people and communities that truly make a place feel like home. What kind of support can LGBTQ plus individuals expect in Brazil? In a country as diverse and vibrant as Brazil, there's a broad spectrum of community support structures that cater to the LGBTQ plus community. These include local LGBTQ plus organizations, healthcare facilities, and various social acceptance levels. Let's start with local LGBTQ plus organizations. Brazil is home to many organizations that work tirelessly to ensure equal rights, provide support, and create safe spaces for the LGBTQ plus community. These include groups like Grupo Gay da Bahia and the Brazilian Association of Lesbians, Gays, Bisexuals, Transvestites, and Transsexuals. These organizations not only advocate for LGBTQ plus rights but also organize events and gatherings, fostering a sense of community and belonging. Next, we'll talk about healthcare. In Brazil, healthcare is a constitutional right, and this extends to the LGBTQ plus community. The country's public health system known as Unified Health System or SUS, provides comprehensive care, including mental health services and hormone therapy for transgender individuals. While the system isn't perfect, it's a significant step towards ensuring healthcare equality. Now let's touch upon social acceptance. Brazil is a country of contrasts. On one hand, it hosts the world's largest pride parade in Sao Paulo, a testament to its vibrant LGBTQ plus culture. On the other hand, it grapples with high rates of violence against the LGBTQ plus community. The social climate varies across regions and cities with urban areas typically more accepting than rural ones. Understanding this contrast is critical. It means that while there are places where the LGBTQ plus community is celebrated and accepted, there are also areas where discretion may be necessary. It's a complex picture but one that's continually evolving towards greater acceptance. So what does this mean for an LGBTQ plus individual considering a move to Brazil? It means that while there are challenges, there are also robust structures in place that provide support, advocate for rights, and foster a sense of community. It also means that, like anywhere else, it's essential to research and understand the nuances of the local social climate. Finding your community is an integral part of settling into a new home. So, is Brazil the right choice for you? After exploring the best cities, diving into legal rights and protections and understanding the community support structures, you have a clearer picture of what life in Brazil could look like. From the lively LGBTQ plus communities of Sao Paulo, Rio de Janeiro and Salvador, to the legal safeguards in place and the supportive structures that exist, this South American gem has a lot to offer. Your next step should include further research into each city, understanding the local culture and lifestyle, and honing in on what feels right for you. Reach out to LGBTQ plus friendly real estate agents in the area, they can provide valuable insights and help you navigate the house buying process. You'll find a list of these professionals in the video description below. Remember, the journey to your new home begins with a single step. We hope this guide has been helpful and wish you all the best in your exciting journey.